Hello, this is Anik Joseph with your News in 90 for Thursday, March 12th. A former daycare driver is on probation after authorities say she left a three-year-old boy in a hot vehicle where he died. Deborah St. Charles originally faced up to 15 years in prison. She was sentenced 10 years probation Wednesday. Authorities say St. Charles left three-year-old Miles Hill in the hot daycare van for 12 hours. According to police, the van's temperature reached up to 140 degrees. Miles was found dead. State officials say St. Charles was not an approved driver. St. Charles says she never meant to hurt the child. In national news, President Trump addressed the coronavirus. In the speech, the president restricted travel from Europe to the U.S. However, he tweeted that it's very important for all countries and businesses to know that trade will in no way be affected by the 30-day restriction on travel from Europe. He says that the restriction stops people, not goods. The Department of Homeland Security says lawful U.S residents and Americans are exempt from this ban. The ban will last up to 30 days with the intent to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. It will take effect on Friday at midnight. Trump says he will not ban travel from the United Kingdom. After the president's speech addressing the coronavirus, U.S. stocks rapidly declined. U.S. stocks are nearing bear market territory. The New York Stock Exchange was halted for 15 minutes on Thursday. Airline stock is taking a hit as well. Delta shares are down 13% and American Airlines shares are down 14%. That's your News in 90. I'm Anik Joseph. And don't forget, your Florida news is always on, on WUFT.org.